we've been farmers forever. I'm a fourth generation farmer on Kangaroo Island. We led a pretty sheltered life here and probably went to the mainland about three times by the time I was 12. There was uh, three of us had a partnership when we first made wine. The business was never going to work like it was. The only way it would work if there was a family that wanted to run it as a family concern. And we were the first to have a commercial vintage on Kangaroo Island. And now we've got the whole family is involved in the wine business. Uh, we originally thought that just being Kangaroo Island wine and a new region would sell our wine but we couldn't have been further from the truth. We had to make some good wine and we had to promote ourselves. A lot of people come there to have a look at the view because the view is spectacular, but the view's not anywhere near as good until you've had a couple of wines, so. <laughs> Proud is not a word I like, but uh, content, I suppose. It's pretty good at the end of the day to have a bottle or two of your own wine and uh, any stresses around, they soon disappear. <laughs> Going back to the beginning of farming on Kangaroo Island, they were pretty well self-sufficient. We can grow our own meat and grow our own wine and we don't need much more than that. A few veggies in the garden and things are good. I think just looking at our beauty, the beaches and the wildlife and everything as it is, one time people were quite bored with that, but now people have got a different attitude. Instead of all the hype in the cities, they want to get away from all that and sit on a beach and drink a bottle of wine and, and, and have a swim and enjoy it for what it is. And people like to get back to nature and be in touch with a bit of reality. You can go to a beach that you love and catch a fish you need it that night and you can go back and do it again tomorrow. We call it island time because we do what we want when we want. We go fishing when we want to, we go farming when we have to and we don't have to obey by nine to five rules or anything like that. It's a better way of doing things. <laughs>